Hi, I'm Miss Margie. Today I'm going to talk about words with consonant blends. To begin, these are consonants. Consonants are the letters of the alphabet that are not vowels. And just as a refresher, vowels are A, E, I, O, U, and sometimes Y. Words with consonant blends are words like these. You have two consonants together that kind of blend when you say them. Brr, brown, blue, green, st, stop, tree. I have a couple more. Try, drink, glass. I'm exaggerating my speech to make a point. They sometimes discuss consonant blends at the end of a word, which would be think, there's the NK, unk, many more. But I think usually in school, they're discussing the consonant blends at the beginning of a word. Then, not to confuse you, but You'll see consonants together like TH, CH, and SH. Those are actually called digraphs. The difference between words that start with consonants like these is that they make one sound. Thing. Cheek. She. Whereas the others, you can hear both letters. In um, she, you can't hear the S and the H separately. In thing, you can't hear the T and the H separately. But in consonant blend words, you can. Tr, dr, gl. I actually do like using color words to make my point with a child because they're pretty familiar with color words. They probably see them in the classroom. They see them on their crayons. And it's always good to use something familiar when you're teaching a new point. I hope that helps. That's really it on consonant blends. But I do want to show you something. Some children have trouble uh, feeling that in their mouth when they say it. They have trouble feeling it in their mouth or they might have trouble writing it and they might have trouble reading it. So I think it's perfectly okay to separate the blends. So if, let me use the word try because it's nice and short. So you could say the word try because they are studying consonant blends and that's how blends are usually pronounced. But I see nothing wrong when you're in the learning process to go try. You can actually break that first sound off of a consonant blend to help a child if they're struggling. Let's just do another one so I can make my point. I'm going to write the word glass. So it could be g glass. G glass. T Rye, d, rink, g, less. That's probably not how the education system is using a consonant blend, but it works just as well if you need it. So anyway, I hope that helps with words with consonant blends. Have a great day. If you'd like to learn more about um, teaching children to read, you can go to my blog at missmargie.com or subscribe below to see some of my other videos. Thank you. This was fun.